and discuss about the complicating narratives of inspiration. Here are some examples for criticism. Number one, inspiration porn. The criticism highlighted in the video is that disabled people are often objects by as sources of inspiration for non-disabled people, a concept referred as inspiration porn. This representation tends to ignore the real challenges faced by disabled individuals and instead use their image to make non-disabled people feel better about their own life. Number two, superhuman, as a lecturer of Wiki Island, where such portrayal aims to show disabled individuals as extraordinary and capable, we can also inadvertently set unrealistic standards and expectations. Number three, lack of authentic representation. As a film called a phrase, when individuals with disabilities are not involved in shaping their own stories, there's a risk of perpetuating stereotypes or presenting a narrative that doesn't fully respect their life experience. Number four, reinforcing negative stereotypes. The media often portrays disabled individuals as pitiable and pathetic, never reinforcing negative stereotypes rather than presenting them as people with their own identities. Here are some ways to address criticism. First, we can showcase the diverse experience and achievements of disabled people without forming them as extraordinary solely because of their disability. Second, we can focus on the everyday lives of disabled people, highlighting both achievements and challenges to provide a more balanced view. To work closely with people with disabilities, they represent to ensure that their companies are truthful, respectful, and empowered. In the book, The Social Construction of Freaks, Rob Abanda implies a need of authentic presentation that respects the agency and the diversity of individuals with disabilities includes representing them as multifaceted individuals beyond their disabilities and involving them directly in how the story are told, forming constant and respectful narratives that empower rather than exploited individuals with disabilities.